As part of the Brazilian season at the Hornman, we've commissioned Jean Abreu, who's this extraordinary Brazilian choreographer, to take over the museum with a program of contemporary dance, music, activity and performances. Labyrinto is labyrinth in Portuguese. The Honeyman Museum, for me, felt like a labyrinth. It felt like I had to discover each room. And Labyrinto is a total chaos, is an organised chaos, a chaos of creativity, where ideas are coming from many different sources and many different directions, and I'm trying to kind of piece them together. It's inspired in a piece called A Thread, and is the relationship with a visual artist called Elisa Brasha, who is from Sao Paulo, and who I developed this project with. Diogo is reciting a text of a writer who is very confusing because she born in Ukraine, she grew up in Brazil, and she writes in Portuguese. I'm very excited to bring this writer, which is a Clarice Spector. She's very famous over there in Brazil. She had a quite unique style. She's very introspective, and that's what we're trying to bring to our performance as well. And this monologue talks about the beginning and evolution of things. The truth. It's always some inner path without explanation. We were taught by our ancestors that our history is something, but we, by fact we don't really know what it is. And that's the questions we bring to the audience. What's yes and what's no? In a museum you always have the choice which room to visit. In Labyrintho I like to imitate that kind of experience. What do you want to follow? What's the performer they want to follow? I'm trying to induce people's instinct. I think Brazil is a world country. It has influences from everywhere, it has references from everywhere. The Honeyman Museum is a kind of a little Pandora box that offers you a window to many peoples and places. The team of the museum gave me a total freedom and I think they took a lot of risk and so did I in many ways and there's an ongoing dialogue. I think it's not going to finish here. I think it's something that is more to explore.